guys welcome to the channel so guys today i'm going to go and get registered for the gym um i've not i've not been consistent at home trying to do it by myself so i just want to look for a place where i can um also join other people so we can be doing this together so today is that day and i thought i should document this i'm super happy about it i'm going to show you guys how it goes and all of them my brother said he's going to join in too he's still around with us so he's going to join in and yeah let's go and burn some fat my stomach is becoming big so we are going to the gym today so i'll see you guys when we get there bye morning guys <laughs> see i'm happy i'm doing this i'm happy i'm going to the gym i'm happy like it makes me feel good because um i don't know i'm actually happy like and i get to meet new people again so that's that's a good feeling so today i'm going today is friday and i'm heading over to the gym i'm waiting for my brother and i'm heading over there so it's basically yeah like it's not gym 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 it, there, there is gym equipment there is everything you need but then we have an instructor it's more like of the things i do at home like when my husband is my instructor but with him anytime i tell him i'm tired i go and i rest but this one because people are there like i get motivated to like do more if i see other people even people that are heavier than me bigger than me they are lifting themselves i'm like and now you can do this don't give up so it's really very encouraging yeah i'm happy and today is i think it's skipping day they ask us come with a skipping rope i don't know i i'm i'm too shy to like fix my camera and show you guys what is happening there because i don't know i don't want them to know i'm a youtuber but then my husband was like oh you should let them know you're a youtuber that's how you build your community and you also get subscribers and all of that but <laughs> i'm shy so i i'm about heading out now we waiting for my brother for only god knows when and how so I'll see you guys um, 
later. Go! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Last Hi guys, good afternoon. Welcome back to the channel. Forgive me for looking like this. Once I'm done cooking, I'm going straight to the salon to go and make sure I look put together. I just got back from the gym. I cleaned the house and I want to cook two soup and then make stew with it um, for the week. And yeah, let me show you guys what I'm about to do. Like I had serious breakout last month due to periods and all of that. So that's that's it let me show you guys what i'm about to cook i'll show you guys the ingredients and then i'll get right into cooking like i've prepped all my ingredients clean the whole place and also let me show you guys so this is what i'm cooking with um, then i have goat meat that i've been boiling here yeah so let's get let's start cooking
let me show you guys so good evening guys welcome back to my channel it's still sunday and i just thought i should come up here and round up this vlog quickly it's still going to go up today so let me just say what i want to say and get out of here so guys if you enjoyed this vlog so far please don't forget to like my video see anytime you click on like button youtube recommend my videos to other people to watch it too so if you enjoy watching my video that much why not just like once you are done watching it's not that difficult please just like my video and youtube will recommend my videos to other people to watch it too so guys i just want to quickly come up here and just talk with you guys briefly before i end this vlog so we went to church today and church was really amazing the service was actually amazing and i can say without my notes i can just i can tell you guys everything that was said in church today but then there was something that hit my head and i thought i should come up here and share with my subscribers that are not my church member or that are not yeah that maybe you did not go to church today but yeah i just wanted to share something with you um today's preaching was all about efficiency of prayer yeah i think so <laughs> after bragging that if i don't look at my note i would be able to tell you people everything yeah specific step to productive praying so today's service was all about um prayer the preaching today was all about prayer and um my pastor made mention of something and i thought i should come up here and like talk to you guys quickly about it he said something that uh, god's will is is an answered prayer waiting for it to be prayed um when 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 he said this it really hits me because uh, it's just like whatsoever we are praying for we already have it but it's just left for us to like open our mouth so that god will bring it into establishment it's just it's just for us to like say oh god i want this and he's ready to like deliver it onto us i heard it i'm not like so is it me that i've been the one hindering myself from the things that god promised me about my life is it me like why why is it so difficult sometimes you'll be like oh god can read my mind no god cannot read your mind he needs you to say it as a man desire as you desire it he wants you to express it into his hearing so that he will hear you he say well even when you are yet praying that he have heard you it's not when you are yet talking not when you are thinking about it that he heard he did not hear your hear your thoughts he heard your prayers so um this is to say <laughs> if you are watching my video and you are believing god for something don't close your mouth on that thing you are believing god for and there is nothing too little to pray about so far the man i'm married to have taught me that there is nothing too little to pray about like little things of this life i have learned so far that there is nothing too small to pray about and there is nothing too big to pray about because there is no situation that you get yourself inside that God cannot bring you out of it. And there is nothing that you are trusting God that he cannot give you. He owns the universe. He owns the cattle of the 10,000 hills. So what is it? Say it to your father. Okay, so for me not to blab too much, I hope you enjoy watching this video. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also click on the notification bell so you get notified when I whenever I post a video. I love you guys. Bye. Mwah.